I'm so hot guys. UK's having a heat wave and I just can't deal with this heat. <laughs> Hey guys, welcome back and I hope you're well. Today's video is a homeware haul, as you can see by the title. I have been doing some shopping for the house again. I'm just so excited to finally have this house finished. We are in the midst of like redecorating at the moment, but I will hopefully be doing a video on what we've done to the house in the future when we've done a bit more. Um, but I have of course been picking up little bits and bobs to go around the house and just brighten it up a little bit. And of course, I'm gonna show you what I've been picking up. So. Without further ado, let's just get straight into it. Here's what I've been buying. So first up, I'm going to start with one of my favorite online brands. This is Decenio. If you haven't heard of Decenio before, where have you been? But also, in all seriousness, they are an online website that sell artwork, prints, frames, and they're just amazing. There's basically something for everyone on there. Kindly partnered up with me on this video, and I do have a discount code for you as well. But first up, I'm gonna show you what I picked up. So. First up, I got this little frame and the artwork inside, and it's basically a big old whale with a little man just swimming next to it. And I really, really love the color of this. I love the blue. I love this kind of like illustration design as well. One of those artworks, it doesn't really mean anything, but it's just really nice to just look at. I just feel really calm. When I saw this on the website, me and Chris were both like, we really like that and that would go really well with like the aesthetics of our house. But it's just so, so pretty. Just really simple, really calming. I just love the colours. I just loved everything about this. And the best thing with Desenio is they are really, really affordable. So this print I think was $13.95, which for a really good print quality is amazing. And the frame was $11.95. So you can get yourself some really nice artwork on there for super cheap prices. So that is the first little one that I picked up. And then next, I picked up one for my office. Again, I haven't decorated my office yet, but I like to put little bits and bobs in it just to make it feel a little bit more like done and a little bit more me, I guess. So I saw this one online and this has got a blush pink background, which I thought was really, really nice. And then we've got these kind of, I guess they're not palm leaves, they're just kind of like plant leaves on the front with a nice shadow. And this is kind of like a photo. Um, I just really like this. I fell in love with the colours. I thought it would look really nice just on my wall, really simple um, and quite girly, but I like that. And um, you can see the colours a little bit better here as well. But yeah, really like this and it's a perfect size just for the little frame that I have on my wall in my videos. I just thought it would look nice in the background of those. So this print was 11 95 and I think the frame was about £11 as well. So again, really good price for such a little cute print. Um, I'll leave all the sizes that I bought and all the links and stuff down below so you can click there if you fancy picking yourself up one of these. And then next up, I've got a slightly bigger one. I don't know how I'm gonna show you this, but I will show you a little cutaway of it anyway, just in case you fancy it. Um, and this one is a personal, a personal preference from me and Chris, because we have visited Norway in the past and we love Norway. Um, I don't know if I'm gonna be able to show you this very well, but this is basically a big old print of um, an illustration of Norway, which I really, really like. It's kind of in the same style as the whale one. And as you can see, it says Norway at the top, and then we go down and we've got this kind of like scenic illustration here. Again, I will put a nice um, cutaway on the screen so you can really see how lovely this one is. Again, it's a really like calming illustration. And because we love Norway so much, I feel like it always takes me back to that two weeks we had in Norway on holiday. I just really like the fact that it has a bit more of a personal meaning to us. So yeah, really like this. And I thought this would go really nicely in our house as well. Um, I love the fact that it has all these different colors in as well. So we've got a bit of blue, a bit of green. We've got this kind of like burgundy stretch here and then obviously the pink kind of writing. So I feel like this would just go anywhere and go with any sort of furniture we've got and stuff like that. So yeah, we did choose wooden frames as well because we are a wooden family. And next up from Decenio, we have this print which is actually more so for Chris's office. Um, if you didn't know, Chris, my husband is a wedding photographer so it's quite fitting um so this is the print and we have kind of like this camera that's just been like taken apart hopefully this never happens 
to any of our cameras. Um, but yeah, I just really liked this. I thought it was kind of like mechanical and like, I don't know, it's just interesting. Like I could look at this all day and see how many screws there are on there. It's kind of like a where's Wally thing. I don't know, it's just cool and different. I haven't seen anything like this anywhere else. Um, and I think that was a similar price as the last one. So it's $21.95. And again, I think the frame was about £11 if I'm right, but I will leave all the links below. So then we have an absolutely massive, massive print. I don't know how I'm gonna show you this because it's bigger than me, um, but I will show you, of course, like a cutaway of it sitting on the floor. Um, but this is the frame. Ooh, it's massive. Is it really showing it off to its best uh, advantage, is it? It's basically a landscape of a cloudy mountain. It's very moody, very, I don't know, it's moody, but it's very white and bright. So it's not like super dark and moody in that way. Really liked our land, we really like our landscapes. Again, Chris was like, I love that. And it would look really nice in our living room, but it is humongous. So I'm gonna put it down because my arms are aching. So this is actually 70 by 100. So it's a very, very big frame, but the print was only 30.95, 30 pound. And I think the frame was 35 pounds. Don't think that's that bad at all. Um, like I said though, I will show you like a little cutaway of that because it's massive and I can't hold it up. <laughs> So like I mentioned, Desenio have kindly given me a discount code for you guys. On Tuesday, the 24th of July, they have a massive sale going live, but my code is an even better offer. So it will give you a massive 35% off all prints. This does exclude frames, so you can't get a discount on the frames, but all of the prints you can get a discount on. This does include the normal posters, the hand-picked posters, and the collaboration items as well. You get 35% off, so you can pick up some really nice artwork for your home, and you need to be quick because it's only valid from the 24th to the 26th of July. Get shopping if you want some Desenio prints. I'll leave the code on the screen now and I'll also leave all the information down below in the down bar including the code so you can just copy and paste it into the checkout. So yeah, we all love saving money, don't we? <laughs> so next up I have some bits and bobs that I picked up on H&M. I actually picked these up on the website recently. I love H&M's homeware. I absolutely love it. I think it's great, really affordable. And um, so I had to pick up some items. So the first thing I picked up was these little hooks. Now, I've got a bit of a thing for hooks. I end up buying loads of different hooks, never use them, but I saw these and I love how kind of rustic wood they are, but also it's very small and dainty, which I like. In our bathroom at the moment, we've got something the old owner's left. It's very big, very clunky, and it's just really ugly. So I bought this thinking that we could replace that one with this one, um, and I really like this. I love the fact that, I don't know if you can see it, but the hooks kind of like tilt upwards as well. I think it's quite subtle, it's quite discreet. It would just look really nice with some towels hanging on it in the bathroom behind the door. Simple item, but something that I think can really like spruce up the bathroom. This was $3.99 as well, so I just have to put it out there. It's a massive, massive bargain that I'm absolutely loving. So yeah, had to pick up that, 3.90, four quid. That's the price of a coffee. So then I have a cushion cover. And like I said, we're decorating the lounge at the moment. We're going for kind of gray colors. And I wanted to get some new cushion covers because I need an update. On the front, we've got this really nice leaf print, which I adore because if you didn't know, we live next to the woods. So our house is kind of very woodlandy. I love that woodland theme. And I love the fact that we're kind of bringing it into the house a little bit. Hence this. It's a really subtle leaf print, but I just really loved it. I love the fact that it's grey as well, and we have like the background being cream. I really like H&M cushion covers. They last really well. I've got some on the sofa at the moment, and I've had them on there, I mean, since we were in an old house way back when. So they have lasted really well, and I have washed them a few times as well. So they do last well, and I think these ones especially, which are like the kind of cotton material, don't bobble at all. $3.99 for this as well. Of course, you do need to buy the insert, the padding, um, but if you have already got those and you just fancy changing them over, $3.99 is a bargain. So I really liked that from H&M. And the next up is my favorite, favorite purchase ever. Um, and it is this, oh, I don't even know. I mean, Chris will hate this. It's a leopard print towel. Oh, I love it. So this is a leopard print hand towel. It's gonna go in my bathroom. Um, I just love the way that if you have a really kind of simple bathroom, like ours is just white, white with a wooden floor, nothing special about it, but you, but you can hang little towels like this and it just changes the theme of the room instantly. 
I have grey towels, orange towels, leopard print towels and every time I have a little clean in there and I change the towels over and I change the bath mat, it just kind of refreshes it for me and I love that. So I picked up this, I just thought it was a really cute kind of typical H&M item. I've got so many towels from H&M with funky things on. It isn't one that you'd want to get out of the bath and put over you, obviously it's too small anyway, but for drying your hands it's absolutely perfect. And this was only £4.99, so it is a bargain. I know it's a towel and it's not going to be to everyone's taste, but I love a little bit of leopard print and I'm super excited to inject some leopard print into my bathroom, just put it out there. I think it's a very, very funky item. In fact, I want it in a top. <laughs> and lastly from H&M, I have a bath towel. Like I said, I do like to buy things for my bathroom. It seems to be the one room of the house that's kind of done and I can just inject a different mat, a different towel in. So I do pick up some bits for there as well. This is a bath mat with a difference though. It's circle, which I thought was really, really cute. I mean, I'm struggling to show you, but there you go. It's a really cool like pattern in the middle. It's kind of like a star flower and it's a circle bath mat, which I think is just really funky, really different. I love the fact that it's circle. I think that's quite a fun take on the bath mat. A sentence I never thought I'd hear myself say, but you know, we're gonna go with it. Um, this was $17.99. Don't think that's awful for a bath mat. I mean, it's not the cheapest, it's not the most expensive, but for the size of it as well, and it's really well made. It feels really nice. It's really kind of like cozy. Um, but yeah, I really liked this. I just, it caught my eye and I had to have it. So next up, I have a little item from Ikea. Now, this is probably the smallest thing I could buy in Ikea that I've ever bought in my life, but I saw them and I thought they were super cute. So it was a pack of three succulents, like so, and I have taken them out of packaging. I can't remember how much they were. I think they were about five pound, um, but I'll try and find them on the website if I can, but they were in the fake flower section in case you're going to Ikea anytime soon. I really love succulents and plants, but I'm not the best at keeping them alive, especially succulents. I find them quite difficult. I think I overwater them, and then they just get loads of flies on them, and I hate that. So I picked up these. I've got a little pot in my bathroom, again with the bathroom, and I just thought these would look really cute um, inside the pot, just sticking out. But yeah, I thought for a fake succulent, they actually look quite real, quite discreet, but I just think they're really cute, and I love Ikea for their fake plants. So if you haven't visited Ikea for fake plants, go and get some, they're amazing. Next up, I have an item from HomeSense, which is my favorite place in the world. Like, if you haven't been to a HomeSense, go. It's basically TK Maxx for home stuff only, but they have some really good bargains. So I picked up this big old basket, which is Circle. So this is for our living room. We have a lot of blankets and a lot of stuff like that. I just wanted somewhere to put them that looked nice. I love the idea of having rolled up blankets inside this basket. I think it would just look really cute, very Pinterest as well. But when I saw the price, I had to buy it. So I can't remember it now. 13 pound, 13 pound. I mean, I've been in Ikea and seen tiny baskets for 13 pounds. So I was really impressed that this was so cheap. They actually had quite a big basket selection in HomeSense, which I wasn't actually expecting, but I could have bought so many. I love baskets and I love this kind of like basket trend that we're in at the moment. I feel like straw bags, baskets for your blankets, straw sandals even, hessian bags. I love all of that style. So had to pick this up. It's kind of like dark and light. So it's kind of like a nice tone of um, basket, if that's what it is. So yeah, really like this. It's a massive basket as well. Like it's absolutely huge. For 13 pound, I was so impressed. So really excited to get the living room finished so I can put some blankets in here and be Pinterest friendly, basically. And randomly, I have some items from ASOS because they do homeware now, who knew? Um, so yeah, I was shopping for my clothes. I picked up a few homeware ASOS orders as well. So the first thing was this lamp, which I just absolutely fell in love with. I think it's such a nice design. Like I said, with the basket, I really love this straw basket trend at the moment. And I think this kind of thing basically goes in every single room. Like it will go with any color, any design that you've got, any furniture. I just think it's a really good idea. I've said this before about straw bags as well. Take one on holiday and they go with every outfit. 
same with homeware. So this was from ASOS and it's by a brand called Chickadee. I think it was about 24, 25 pounds, which I didn't think was too bad for a lamp. Um, it has little white feet on the bottom as well. Um, and then it has like this, I mean, you can't really see it. It has a white kind of um, base, but then the straw covers it as well. And then we've got a little on off switch. I just had to pick this up and I think for 25 pound, it's definitely not as bad. And I definitely picked up a pair of shoes for the same price, so yeah. I don't know, I really like this. So well done to ASOS for finally doing homeware. I'm so excited to see what they have coming up on there because I think they'll do well. And next up from ASOS, I got a rug. Now this is not to everyone's taste, I know for a fact, because I'm not even sure if it's to mine, but it is a very bright, very in your face rug. This again, I think is by the same Chickadee brand, but I could be wrong, I can't find the label on it. Um, but this was 24 pound and it is, a rainbow rug. I just really like rainbow at the moment. I really enjoy all of the colours. I'm loving the fact that this will go again in any room. It will go with a really neutral room or a really bright room as well. Um, it is. I did originally think it could be used in the bathroom as a bath mat, but I think it is a little bit too big for our bathroom. But if you have got quite a big bathroom um, and you've got a lot of floor space, this would definitely look really cool. I think with tiles and just white, I just love it. It's basically like little bits of ribbon sewn in and then you've got the ends. Um, it's really well made and I think it's really clever how they've made it as well. I just really like this, it really caught my eye. I had to get it just to see what it's like. Again, I'm not sure if it is for me at the moment because our house isn't very brightly coloured. Um, and my office obviously isn't decorated yet. Rainbow stuff is a massive trend at the moment. It's absolutely everywhere, especially within clothing. So I thought, you know what? In homeware, it could work as well. So we'll see. We'll see how I get on with that one. Oh, I'm so hot. I'm literally so hot. I'm sticking to this chair. So then I have some candles because a girl loves candles. I actually got these items in a couple of goodie bags that I was lucky enough to receive when I went to a few Next events recently. So the first one is this candle. This is apricot and wild herbs. I have burnt this one because I wanted to burn them and see how they smell when they're burning. I can confirm these do smell amazing and you can definitely smell them when they're burning as well. Not only that, I've had it next to my desk for a little while and even when it's not burning, I can really pick up the smell, which I absolutely love. I love being able to smell a scented candle. We've all had times when we've bought scented candles and we just cannot smell them and that is not good. So it's very fresh, very kind of fruity, I'm not very good at describing scents, but I like it. So that is the first one. And I also love how yellow this is. I think it's a design feature in itself. And the next one I have is Fig and Elderflower. This one is a little bit sweeter. I think I prefer the yellow one, but I love the packaging of this one. Like how pink and cool is that? I mean, I love them together. I feel like it's the kind of thing every time I go into Next now, I'll need to see what colors they've got and I'll need to buy them. So that's not good. So that is everything I've picked up for the house recently. I really hope you enjoyed this haul. Of course, if you did want to pick up any of these items or just have a look at them on the website, I'll leave the links to absolutely everything down below. I'll also leave the links to what I'm wearing. I absolutely love this little t-shirt. Okay. Um, so I leave all the links to this and the earrings and the lipstick and everything down below as well. So you can click on that and go and buy the bits. I will leave the code to the Desenio discount down below if you're interested in purchasing some artwork as well. Like I mentioned, you get 35% off all artwork. It does exclude frames, but you have to be quick. It's only valid on the 24th of July till the 26th of July. So you only have a couple of days. So get shopping. You can pick up yourself an artwork shaped bargain which is always good in my eyes so yeah As always thank you so so much for tuning in and watching give the video a nice big thumbs up if you enjoyed it and i'll see you again next week for another video have a lovely day whatever you're up to and yeah have fun bye guys Mwah.